All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so today I'm eating some nachos. Okay, so if you're new to the channel, please be subscribed to the channel and subscribe. Even if you aren't, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Leave us some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook. Interact with us because you do like to hear from me. I'm going to say grace and get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive for nourishment for our bodies and health. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hopefully, I forget. I mean, I not forget. Remember to put the thing on no. close up no. in here. Stop picking in there and take a bite. Take a bite. Who do you want to sit there and freaking uh? Mm -hmm. Me some sour cream. I made them quesadillas though. Chicken quesadillas. I uh was about to say mess uh, I made them some chicken quesadillas and these are chicken nachos. So I got uh chicken, black beans, uh pico cheese, a whole lot of cheese, um, jalapenos. That's it really. Um I got my tartar sauce. I, no, okay. Now y'all know I like to put all my um, Mexican food, nachos and tacos and such, but just, I don't know. I love the flavor. All right. So happy, Dad. I have been really wanting, ever since that taco fest, man, I've been wanting some dang old uh, nachos. And I would get some, but. Um, no, happy turkey day. We will. Yeah. Another egg. Um. Mm -hmm. Take a bite. This one has dang on dang on taste of beer. Usually I get some deconstructed. Take a bite. Usually I get some deconstructed tacos because. You ain't gonna bite in your shadow. I'm gonna put some um, cheese sauce on these, but. Mm. Cheese sauce. Mm. 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 And I really should have baked them first before I broiled them so that all my cheese could melt. I need better. But I'm glad, but, um. We didn't go back there down there the second day because I heard my sister said they were shooting down there. I said we can't have nothing nice, man. Mm. You just can't get tacos and peach man. But I wonder if it happened, you know, what time of day it happened. You know, if it happened in broad daylight versus at night time. Are you done? I'm done. I'm Stop playing with it. That's okay. Because um, back home in Cleveland, was it the Latin Fest or Puerto Rican Fest, whichever one of those. Always the end in chaos. <laughs> I feel like I always heard anyway. I never went, but you know, I think I might have went one time, maybe.
But I don't even people will not be acting up because we outside, man. Dang. Mm -hmm. Uh, it was like those had moles, but I don't know. And maybe that's why I've been wanting this chicken nacho because I had moles. Yeah, hopefully I remember uh, to put my dang old clothes uh, in here because uh, I forgot. I was sorry about it. yesterday. So I said, I ain't putting it in. So uh, it was good. It was looking good. Mm -hmm. I mean, if I do say so myself, you know. Cut my grass today. I had to. I mean, it was time it needed to be cut. Now, if I didn't cut it today, I would have cut it in the morning. But well, only because I was skeptical of the weather it was going to um, rain or not, because the clouds were so thick. It was casting in shadows, and it was just looking like it was going to rain. But So it ain't raining this way all evening. Apparently, when I looked at my little weather app, it was raining in Columbus at some somewhere at, at one point. But it was raining, and my neighbor he had cut his grass today. His lines looked so tight. I said, "Oh no, I'm about to cut my grass." And it was nice. He yeah. came out, and we had a nice little conversation. Yeah. Who's from um Zimbabwe? Zimbabwe. <laughs> Uh, the house was on um, um, a hunt. Well, it had an accent and an accent. Pretty thick one, too. And this neighbor, like I, we've talked before, he's pretty cool. Um, What's the other ones that I ain't seen? The ones that got the boy that he be out, he be salty when he be cutting that grass. Y'all hear me? Um, but yeah, he might have been one of the first people that I met when I moved. Um, yeah. Um, people didn't do the neighborly thing that I thought they was going to do, you know, come and introduce okay. themselves or whatever. Yeah. Like, maybe get a care package or something. I mean, I do that for the neighbors that moved in over here either. But I just feel like. But I only for the liberal that lived to the left of me. And then I called him that dang Ben. Why I call him that? Because I, 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 I don't know. I don't even know why I made this up in my head because it probably wasn't him. But, you know, whenever I um, first moved over here, um, 
People kept, somebody had to have reported that my graph wasn't cut because they said people were saying that that's the only reason why they were seeing notices or whatever Some if somebody reported it. I don't feel like it was so child because I wasn't even, I hadn't moved in. I hadn't bought the house, but I had moved in, didn't have a long one or nothing, so. And I was annoyed. I told him, I said, y'all ain't sent me no bylaws or nothing and told me what I'm supposed to, what rules I'm supposed to hear, adhere to. How I know I done broke a rule, you know? Um, and that was me talk, talking to the HOA folks. But anyway, he had came over and introduced himself one time. I was sitting on the porch. Um... So, yeah, man, y'all know I got that little, um, I don't know if I remember, I got a little swing on the porch. And I should have put it up during the winter, but I left it out. And while I didn't damage too bad, but I definitely need some work to shout out to my uncle. Because I talked to him. Was it yesterday? Who was yesterday? Or the day before? I think it was the day before yesterday, it was Saturday. And uh got me together to tell me what I need to do. To have it looking brand new. Something else I want to do. I got a swiffer, but I want to mop these floors, man, because they just The Swiffer ain't getting them clean like I want to be. All right, get me a mop. Mm. Yeah. I'm not playing too much, y'all. I really love these Tostitos canteen chips, the one with the blue label, because these are the thicker ones. They're just so cranky. But yeah, my uh, but like I was saying, my neighbor had cut his grass today. His lines were looking too good. And I was like, all right, well, I'm about to go out here and hopefully, you know, it don't uh, rain on me. And it didn't, so I'm grateful. I got baby But my yard looks kind of like trash though, man, because they still got them leaves everywhere. But, oh, that's a, a, a squirrel. Okay, squirrel. So, how we got on the subject of where he was from because I forget what we was talking about before him. But, oh, he said he came over and told me that he was like, your camera doesn't like me because it kept whistling at him when he was cutting grass because we share a little bit of yard. Like, he got my, some of my yard is some of his or whatever. And I'm sure he was like, you know, I don't know about to cut my grass and her grass sitting high, you know, making my little yard look bad. So he cut the little part of my yard that's connected to his or whatever. But, um, was about to say, so he, he was telling me that while he was cutting the grass, cutting grass, that my camera didn't like him. And then I just happened to ask if him and his wife were, um, planting you know, growing stuff in their garden this year. And he said, oh, yeah, we grow every year. He said, 
that they have been living here like they built they they are the original builders or homeowners of their home and they've been here since the subdivision or whatever has been here and he told me before but he told me again today that my house was the last house to be built over here um but yeah he said that like even where he's from africa in Zimbabwe, like they're pretty used to, like everybody has a, some garden and everybody's growing something or whatever. And he said that they still eat, you know, some of the vegetables and stuff that they, that he said they always grow vegetables and they still eat, you know, what they grew last year because they freeze it. And I was like, yeah, that makes sense. So <laughs> I was told, I was talking, I was like, yeah. I said I was gonna get out there this year and plant something. I just need to go and clear it out too. But I was like, yeah, because right now it look like trees. <laughs> it do good. But he said he didn't know exactly what the people before me planted, but it looked like they have some sort of vegetables or whatever. I'm gonna try to get my green thumb on. In the front and the back, I wanna um a couple folks got these in this a certain kind of plant or whatever that I want to get. So I'm gonna get that and put it in the front because I, I want a plant that I okay. I'm not about to sit up here and be planting flowers and stuff over here. That's not in my ministry. I want something that I put out there this year. And it's just gonna keep reblooming or do whatever it's gonna do. Stay all year round. Whatever. I just wanna plant it once and it'll be good. So obviously there's probably gonna be some sort of plant just no. I've seen a couple that I like. Mm -hmm. Just around here. Wow. Touch that. <coughs> well, I can't wait. 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 Wow. I'm getting on my nerves and carrying on. All right, y'all. Well, I'm full, so um, I don't think to buy here. Right. Um, but it was like it was pretty much packed. So I, I wish I need to. I should have got that other the one thing. Let's see if I can prop it up so y'all can see. But um. On that note, we're going to peace out of here. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. Let us know. Things you like to see us try. Things you like to see us cook. Interact with us because if you like to hear from me. And subscribe to the channel. Go and subscribe. And hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace out.